What is going on today? Welcome to another episode of the Stay Smooth Shaving Show. I want to say I hope everyone's having a good time out there and shaved them, had a good day and a great shave. Gonna get right into it. Boom! Cologne Roos from Barris Druin Man. Great soap. Digging Barris Druin Man. B and M. Blowing up. Blowing up. Up in the studio today. Great shave with it. Got this probably embarrassed to say like a month ago, and I'm just getting to it. Now I did buy the Cologne Roos Cologne when it first came out, and I gotta say, I didn't like it. I'm not a big Bay Rum fan, I know, I, I just, it's okay, but it, it ain't for me. And this kind of had a Bay Rum scent to it, that's why it kind of threw me off. Then I was watching Jammin' G.I. Ims, Jammin' G.I. Doing a shave with this, and he was saying he didn't like it at first either, but he gave it a chance. He learned to embrace the scent, and I took his advice. Thank you, sir. That's a good note for all of you out there. Give things a chance. Let it bloom. Let it see what it does to your face, on your face. Anyway, the scent, it's old school. It's actually mirrored off of a classic scent. Now, I couldn't memorize this, so I'm going to read it to you now. Oops. I actually went to the wrong one. What's up with that? There we go. Based on an oldest forms of perfume cologne, Rus is a throwback scent created by the House of Glurian by the Russian royal family and is discontinued in the early 20th century. But this is where it gets interesting. Notes of lemon, bergamot, pedigrain, herbs to dry down to violet, rose, bay, that's what threw me off, vanilla, and amber. It's clean and elegant. Cologne Rus is the perfect way to finish your shave off, brighten your morning in the winter. It's geared to a winter scent. But I did not like it. But when DFS decided to come out with their shave soap, I had to get mine. So of course I went to Barrister and Man. And at the time, this was on sale, I believe. So I picked one up. I don't think you can find one anymore. I, I've looked, I've looked at Shave Revolution, I've looked at um, Barrister and Man, I can't find it. And I don't remember what I paid for it. The cologne aftershave is $20.95. If you're gonna get one, you better might as well get the other. Back to the story. Now, when I smell a scent, I usually like the aftershave more. This is the total opposite. Because the shave, the shave soap, the shave soap is usually less scented than the aftershave, and I prefer that with this scent for some reason. And I think it's the bay in there. I could be wrong. I don't know, but it is growing up. But the soap, the soap, my goodness, performed excellent. It lathered like a dream. It is thirsty, but that's to be expected with Barrister and Man. So. I'm going to keep it short and simple. I love Barrister and Man. It always impresses me. I get a nice, refreshing, irritation-free, paired it with the Satin Tip White Fiber Persona Lab Blue in my McCord 34C. So here we go. Barrister and Man Cologne Russe. Slickness. Being a tallow soap when I have hard water, it was nice. I'm going to give it a 9.5 on slickness cushion. I have to give it a 9.9 on cushion. It was right there. It's right there. Uh, Poche face fill is right there as well. I'm gonna give it a 9.7. The scent, I gotta be honest, when I first bought this, I would've gave this scent like a 4.5. But now, as it's grown on me, I think I'm gonna give the scent about an eight. It's not bad. Jumped up a lot. Um, scent strength, it's about a 5.5. Six in that area, but overall, Bear's Turn Man performance is out of this world. Loving Bear's Turn Man, they are definitely rising on my scale. Oh, yes, and that is coming by the way. Almost went through my soaps, but to, to finish off this review, Bear's Turn Man Cologne Russa is gonna get a 9.8. That's right, Bear's Turn Man rising 
up the charts of my favorite top 10 scents. And as soon as I get through the soaps I have, I will definitely put a top 10 out there. I've been asked so many times what are my favorite soaps um, in order, this and that. And I will rank them in order. It's not going to be, this is my 10 and any one can be a 10. I don't like that. It's going to be 10 to 1, 1 being number 1. No doubt about it, in my preference. So that is the show today. Hope you enjoy Cologne, Roos, Barrister, and Man. Go get you some, if you can, if you can find it. I know you can find a cologne, but I don't know if you can find a soap. And if you can, get you some, because it's a classic. It was made for the Shave Market 2015. It's going to be a collector, collector's item, I think so. So go get you some. That is the show today. Respect yourself, respect the day, respect others. Until then, stay smooth.